Welcome to Inside the Huddle. I'm Mike Joseph for the Lafayette Sports Network and GoLeopards.com. A huge weekend for the Leopards. They put up 50 points against Robert Morris. A little bit of revenge. William and Mary this week down in Virginia. Lafayette has had some luck down in Virginia against teams. Hopefully it can continue this week. Today we're going to talk about a little bit about the 4-2-5 defense that everybody's seen and really welcomed from Art Link. The kids have done a great job with it running to the football. It starts really with almost the basis of a 4-3 defense right here. Four men up front and then those three linebackers. It comes from basically Jimmy Johnson's 4-3 or almost a uh, nickel type defense. But in the 4-2-5, you remove one of those linebackers from the box and he becomes basically a striker, a hawk, a cat, whatever you want to call him. He's an extra speedy outside linebacker. And then you, those two inside linebackers remain in the box. So we get what we call a 4. 2 and 5 in the back. That's your 4-2-5 defense. Inside, the four men up front and the two linebackers are responsible to con create confusion and spill the ball to the outside. So you can do a lot of different things in here. And you've seen this from Art Link. You've seen creating confusion at the line of scrimmage and making that ball spill to the outside. Constrict the inside running lanes and that allows everything to go to the outside. So the six men inside really play independently from the back five, okay? And those back five can play independently of each other. These three right here over two. The backside free safety and corner can play two deep coverage. They can play two sky coverage. They can do a lot of different things and you can get that free safety into the box. So you create a lot of confusion up front, you play with a lot of leverage, and then the last thing is you really try to get that eight-man front. This cat or this striker, whatever you want to call them, becomes that outside linebacker to the field. The free safety can become the, basically the outside linebacker to the weak side. So you create an eight-man front, very difficult to run against. So we constrict the inside lanes, we spill everything to the outside, and we use a lot of speed on the outside. And then the last thing I really want to talk about is the uh, ability of this defense to really conform to different type of offenses. It's really made, I think, to stop the spread offense. This week we're going to see William and Mary a little more conventional. Tight end, running back, quarterback under center, probably really tailor-made for Lafayette's defense. We're going to see you down in William and Mary this weekend.